Welcome back to my channel. So if you are new here, then do not forget to hit that subscribe button down below. And if you are a returning viewer, then welcome back to my channel. Today's video is about this makeup look that I have done using products which are worth rupees hundred only. I did went a bit over for like mascara and blush because like hundred and five and hundred and five are like. I think it's okay. Hundred and hundred and five are okay, right? Um, but you still feel that I did cheat? Let me know. Comment down below because I cannot find anything for my eyes uh, in under hundred, and I did not wanted to use ADS because I did not sorry, something in my. I did not wanted to use ADS because the color payoff uh, for those eyeshadows are not good. Like personally, the ones that I have do does not have any color payoff whatsoever. So. This is what I have come up with and I know I messed up with my eyes. They are not quite blended if you can see. If you think it is worth watching, please keep on watching. If you think that this is shit, then please do not watch it. Um, I really had fun doing this makeup because this was the toughest task. You have no brushes, you have no tools to blend out things and uh, that's the most difficult part of this whole Thing. and I saw Shreya Jain do this makeup like she created this whole challenge of full face of makeup using products under 100 rupees and when I saw her I was like mm, that's so easy I can do that but when I literally when I sat down to do this I was like what should I do I don't have anything to put on my face but thankfully I came up with this and if you think it is worth watching then please continue watching because the products that I have used are mostly under 100 and a two products, two or three products above 100 but also I've given a lot of options if you want other things to work for you like you can go for other things as well I've given a lot of options to try out not just one thing I've stuck on to just one thing like for primers I have options for uh, foundation I have options for lipsticks I have options for eyeliner I have options so you can do or use pretty much anything that you want and also I've not used just any brands I have used brands which are like easily available to you except for the lipstick which is like in color matte mean tester size which I got from Instagram I'll link that down below also I did a lipstick challenge before this apart from that I did not do and five minutes makeup challenge as well if you guys are interested in seeing that check out the description box and also the details of all the products that I have used in the making of this face are in, are in the description box and I should like stop rambling and let's get into the video. Let's get started. We will start off with priming our face. I have like quite a few options which are under 100 rupees that you can use as a primer. Obviously we are not going to use primer primer but I have few options that you can actually use as primers and they work just fine. So the first things up are aloe vera gel which can be used as a primer. You can use Patanjali aloe vera gel which is like just 80 rupees for this big bottle and then you can use green leaf aloe vera gel which is again 100 rupees for 100 ml. Oh, aloe vera gel is just wonderful. Then I have two other options which are from Eva Halal which is a reputed brand. Guys, the product that I am using are from good as well as brands that are not good or considered not good but I have been using those products and I think they're just fine. The products have the same ingredients that other products have so why to have that fuss? Uh, basically but i have tried to use brands that are well known but still there are few brands which are like chinese brand or korean brands which are uh, which people still like uh, so yeah I, I i'm just making that clear i am not sure how good quality they are or how bad quality they are but since i have been using them i will be using them in this video as well so the next products that you can use as a primer if you have dry skin they, these are amazing anyways these are amazing uh, if for like as a primers are Eva Halal Aloe Aqua Com like these two came in a combo of five so this is Eva Halal Aloe Aqua Refreshing Face Spray and this one retails for 99 rupees for a big bottle like this this is around uh, how much is this 100 ml and they also have a face gel which is again for 95 rupees again very affordable and a very reputed brand these are cruelty free so you can use these as primers as well amazing again and the last thing that you can use as primer is something which you have been using since childhood is 
Vaseline. You get it right. Vaseline is an amazing primer. It can be used as a primer. It has a bit of stickiness to it, which makes it perfect uh, as a primer. And if you have dry skin, this is like a lifesaver primer and a lifetime supply of primer. So yes, you can use Vaseline as well for your primer. So those were all the options that you can take as primers. But for this video, I will be using the green leaf aloe vera gel because somehow Patanjali aloe vera gel doesn't work for me and this one works for me. I don't know why. But yes, I'm going to use this on my face as a primer. I'll just dab some on my T-zone, on my cheeks and then just Massage it into my skin into circular motions. I'll take that on my eyes as well and uh, my under eye area because it's good. Anyways, aloe vera gel is good, right? Also on my neck. Also the brushes that I have been using are also very, very, very affordable and accessible to anybody. And I don't know how they will perform. <laughs> so yeah. If you guys have been following me for a while, you guys know that I like to powder my face first before going into the foundation because I have a really sweaty T-zone and that, and this helps in preventing that sweat. So I'll be taking some baby powder. This one, by the way, is from Libero and it is just 48 rupees, guys. Even cheaper than Johnson's baby. So this is 48 rupees and 400 grams can't get cheaper than this i'm just gonna take that much and just rub it on my hands dust off extra and just dab it on my face you guys must have seen me doing this in my lazy day makeup as well so i do this all the time to prevent sweat from my face I can in fact skip my foundation after this or my BB cream or whatsoever so but for the sake of the video I will be using Pond's BB cream the small size of this retails for I guess 95 rupees this is however 18 grams and, and this one retails for 140 rupees but I guess um, the smaller bottle 9 gram is uh, of a cheaper of cheaper price I guess it's 95 or 90 rupees you can also use Blue Heaven foundation this one is uh, again 30 ml bottle and this retails for 65 rupees which is very 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 affordable i also recommend inveda bb cream this one isn't fair and it is off for all skin types this is however for 140 rupees but you can always get it at a discounted price for 90 95 rupees so yeah but for this video we will be going in with the pons bb cream i am not using blue heaven foundation because it has a very peculiar and strong and intense fragrance which actually triggers my migraine and since i have been having migraines almost every single day nowadays so i just don't want my migraine to get triggered but if you hire somebody who is okay with the smells and all those things uh, you can always go ahead and use it i have used it a couple of times but i am not using it just because it triggers my migraine the intense smell actually so blue heaven products are by the way very good minus the smell if they have this if they just reduce the smell somehow um, they are really amazing otherwise because of i just don't use them because of the smell so i'm just taking that much on my finger and then i'll just dab it onto my under eye first because i don't have a concealer And then just blend it out with my fingers because that's the way, best way. Just going in with a bit of uh, aloe vera gel again because I think it's a bit drying. I don't know why today, but yeah. And also, it will just take off any excess of the excess product from my face just go with the back of your hands so that any extra product which has been there on your face is taken off by the back of your hand okay we are done now now we'll move on to the eyes first and then the rest of the face so uh, i'll do the baking under my eyes first which i usually do even in my normal videos when uh, before even concealing before even concealing i like to do my under eyes first so i'm taking this wedges i don't know from where i bought these but these are really affordable um, one wedge would cost you around 50 rupees so i'm using this and i just apply it on my under eyes 
and this is really good if you want that cat eyes uh, it helps in getting that as well and plus it will highlight your under eyes and prevent them from creasing now wet this and then use it right. these were by the way my first ever makeup sponges that i bought like one and a half two years ago Done, done. Okay, so let's move on to the eyes. Let's come closer. I'll just fill in my eyebrows first. I'm using this eyebrow pencil from ABS. This was like just 10 rupees. Can you read that? And in fact, you can buy Lakme's uh, eyeshadow eyebrow pencil. That is also very affordable. So I'm just gonna fill in my... This is nice actually and the trick now I'll be using a toothbrush and just comb my eyebrows so if you have nothing just use your old toothbrush to do this like literally if you have nothing so I'll just comb my eyebrows next for my eyes I really wanted to do a smoky eye like literally I wanted to do a smoky eye so I will be using uh, the Blue Heaven blush. This is this is this is in the shade five zero five, and it's a brown colored blush. And I and it has a very bad smell, like literally very bad smell. And I will be using it as my transition color. I'll go in with my fingers probably for this. I'll use a sponge tip applicator to get it like with almost all your cosmetic things and these are really really affordable. I'll just use that. I think we are done with the transitioning. Oh my god, I don't have a high level. What do I do? This is so difficult. Like literally without the brushes, I can't even like I have done makeup. When I was a beginner without brushes and now I just don't think that makeup is possible. And I did use the aloe vera gel as a primer so we are shorted. Don't need a eyeshadow primer there. I have two options for the kajal. One is this. This is from Blue Heaven. It's their like big one. And this was like 50 rupees. You can also buy Lakme kajal which is also similar form and it is also very affordable. Or if you are really low on budget, go for this one. This is like just 10 rupees and I'm going to use this one exactly. In fact, use these kinds of uh, things uh, before as well. So this is how it looks like and I'm going to just um, line my lower like my lash line and then just smoke it out it's like super blendable so you don't have to work too hard with this I'm gonna take a pink lipstick for the inner half and this one is from 7 heaven it looks like uh, l'oreal color riche i guess that's the name so i'm going to take a bit of this on my inner then you just blend everything out the blue heaven blush in this pink color and i'm using these brushes which are like 100 rupees for the set of five brushes to blend out because it's really difficult to blend everything with your fingers or sponge applicator so using that since i did do not have a highlighter i'll just take the that brown blush till my brow bone 
because it has a bit of sheen to it so yeah I'll just do that I'll use that blue heaven kajal to align as well So you can use a mascara as well and that way it's 2 in 1 and you get like 125 rupees for mascara but you are actually using it for line as liner as well so just divide that by 2 and you are a good just going in with that pink color more because I think it's not showing up much and then with the brown color I'm done with my eyes and for my lower lash line I'll just take that brown shade in my brush like the same brush and then just smooth it out a little bit this kajal to what tight line and Okay, and it's time to get rid of all this baking. I'm using this puff by the way which is like really expensive. You can get it at a local market for 20-30 rupees. Okay, I will be contouring with the same brown color blush from blue heaven it's more like bronzing than contouring these are again the same brush set which i got for 100 rupees you can get it at local market you can in fact use a brown lipstick as well for this for the brush i'm using this pink blush from blue heaven again I think I can use this as a highlighter as well if I use it. It has a bit of sheen to it too. I can neglect my highlighter on my cheeks maybe. I think I can do with that. It's really light pink. Yeah, it's really subtle highlight. Oh, it's a really subtle blush. And I'm loving it basically because I really, really, it gives like a flow of blood from within like as if I'm blushing naturally and not over the board. Though it is like really badly pigmented. You have to go into the pan again and again. I'll use the same thing to highlight my nose as well because... It does have a shine to it. My brow bone highlight, I'm going to take that powder and just clean up basically and do nothing. Look at that. I did apply that brown uh, blush till top of my upper, like till, the, till my brow bone, and when I clean it up, it gives a shine and the color is gone basically. Yeah, just cleaning it up. For the lipstick, <laughs> for the lipstick, I have like quite a few options. If you want to apply a liquid lipstick, you can go for the In Color Matte Me in Tester Size. I have already reviewed these. Or you can go for the Colorish no, the Seven Heaven Color Intense Lip Colors, which are also hundred rupees. So yeah, you can go for any of those. I will be going for this one from In Color because I love liquid lipsticks. You guys know that. I think so. I'm just going to do go for this one. This is like a nude shade, just applying that. I don't know. I'm not quite happy with this. 
think I'll go in with the lipstick as well. I'm happy with it now. Yeah. I'm DIY also a draw, obviously. So one last thing left is this and do that I obviously wear. I am again using Blue Heaven. I have used a lot of Blue Heaven products because they were really affordable. Um, I did not show you the liner because I used the Kajal as a liner but you can obviously go for the Lakme liner which is like just 70 rupees or the L18 liner which is like 80 rupees or even Blue Heaven, liner, Blue Heaven liner if you want a bit of spark. So this is just for 50 rupees I guess. So yeah, those are all the products that I used in the making of this whole look which was under 100 rupees. I did not apply mascara as well. So I'm again using a Blue Heaven mascara which is amazing like it gives me amazing lashes but it is 125 rupees so again a bit over the board but I'm using blue heaven symbol which is like 10 rupees I like red not the maroon one so yeah. And yeah, this is the finished look. Um, I hope you guys really enjoyed the entire making of this look. And if you did so, then don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Some thanks to the Shreya Jain, the, the gorgeous Shreya Jain, to bringing up such a nice idea where you can use products under 100 rupees because not everybody can afford or want to buy products which are really expensive. And it was really good if you are a college going girl or just starting on with makeup. You can use all these. You can use all these products to create looks like these obviously i messed up with my eyes but i showed you a couple of options as well so you can use whatever works for you suits you if you like this video then don't forget to give this video a thumbs up subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and i shall see you in my next video till then take care bye